Hello everyone, so it's RJ here, and so I take the scales with another game of FTL, Faster Than Light. Uh, with the SMPK Insurrection Mod, created by Slow Rider X Core, represented by, from Captain by Sleeper Service. Anyway, the uh, ship mod I'll be trying out with the um, Insurrection is something called uh, the Advanced Weapons Roulette, or Augmented Weapons Roulette. So when you start a new ship, you get different weapons every time you, um, you get, you get, you get really cool weapons. <laughs> <laughs> you, you can get different weapons every time you uh, load a new, uh, every time you load up the ship. So, let's see here. For the Kestrel, for example, you can get a Tactical Burst Laser 3. Fires four shots for three power, and you get Thermal Athena missiles. But then you can hit, hit this one, you get, oh, look at that. Hardened Hull Lasers for a certain amount of damage. But then, but then, now, here's the fun part. Go back to Kestrel. The level weapons changed. The Tactical Burst Laser remains, but now it's Elite Orcus Rockets. Wow! Switch back here again. Burst laser one, an ionic hull laser, a thermal burst laser two, and a blade of um, <laughs> a blade of Artemis missiles. Yeah. So the idea in getting it here is that all these ships have been changed, in that they have a um, they can have a randomized loadout in most cases, like the crystal the crystal. The crystal B is going to have like the it's going to still have a crystal lockdown bomb. The SMPK version, but for some reason now the ship is just a big joke. Where's my three crystals? Why can't I get my three crystals? Why is it a rock and a rock? Why is it a... <laughs> hmm. Why is it a rock and a crystal now, rather than... Yeah, rather than the, um, stuff. Okay, honestly, I can't actually read, like, I'm trying to read the restream chat on my own browser, but I can't seem to actually read it because it's because of its settings. I mean, I can read it just fine. I can read it just fine on the YouTube stuff and on the preview windows, but yeah, that'll work. Or I could just pop out the chat here from YouTube, and that will work too. So I can monitor the stream for um. <laughs> yeah, I can. Look at that. The advantage of having two screens. Anyway, so I should um. Yeah. Well, the thing is, the restream chat window is transparent, and I have it actually on the screen window itself. Anyway, the um, I should point out the uh, ships, the ships that are currently available. Okay, we have a um, I got a whole range of ships that are available, and um, yeah, and they all have different weapon. They can all get different weaponry. I've actually tried a few of these ships off camera, so I'd like to know if um, anyone's interested in a um, like a specific ship in general. Like, I don't know, give me a, give me a ship, give me a ship type, and I'll uh, show you what weapons it can have and. I'll see which ones look good for what in terms of uh, firepower, because some of these ships can even get even better when you give them a um, when when they have a when they have a certain loadout. And that's where if you say Rock A, <laughs> if you say the Rock A, I'm going to <laughs> okay Slug A. Hmm, how have I got this integration rate? Oh, look at that, a Stingray. Has a cut. You can get you can get a custom burst laser. <laughs> And the thermal anti-bio beam. So, this one. Not, not only this. Not only can this. Um, not only can this bio beam kill enemy kill enemy infantry. It can also set them on fire. This. <laughs> yeah. And a mini breach bomb, which doesn't really seem much. Okay, I'm gonna risk it though, and I'm gonna show a different layout. Oh, I switch from an anti-personnel laser and a tactical small bomb. Oh, okay. Yeah, so that's interesting. It can switch out. It switches out. Um, yeah. <laughs> I'd go for the fire beam. That's a salvaged. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. I think we could, I think we should fly this one. Okay. We got a hole. La we got the custom hole laser. Fires. Wait. Okay. Yeah. Ah, so it's so it fire, this one fires faster. But these two weapons here, look at that anti-personnel energy bomb. <laughs> yeah, so if I, so I think we drop if we drop these together. If, if these two are dropped in the same, if these two are dropped in, we're gonna see some serious. We're gonna, there's gonna be some serious um awesomeness going on, I guess. Yeah, some serious um. Some, 
doesn't have more subs because I bet I built a hundred subs. <laughs> I think I kind of sunk all. The, I think I've sunk all those submarines with my own. Yeah, I know. So anyway, yeah, I, I don't. I don't like to um advertise. Like I don't. I don't go out there saying, "Hey, everyone, check out my channel." I might subtly. I might subtly talk about it. Might say to a few people, hey, I got an interesting, I got a video you might be interested in, but I don't say, hey, check out my video, please like, favorite, subscribe, and sub to everything I have. And you know, like, just put a like on everything because, hey, why not? I like my spam messages. Anyway, I think I should begin with a stingray. This is probably going to be an awesome anti-personnel ship. I should also mention the, um, the ships get a, um, that when you, um, the ships have a, Every ship kind of starts at four power now because some of these custom weapons, some of these custom weapons out there, they um use up a lot more power than normal. So if you had a normal loadout, Doctor so Try and Rescue, hey, welcome aboard, Doctor Jones. Welcome aboard. You're now operating shields. Look at that. I've got myself, got myself a uh, shield dude, shielder dude. And look at that. Forward scale the Rebel Fleet. I uh, can't really hear. I can't really hear much of the game audio itself. So I've got a forward scout here. May have to move in quickly on this one. May have to muscle in quickly on its turf. Okay, shield it down. No, no. Okay, well, that's fine. Wasn't actually using that. Wait, what did I do that for? Ah, sorry. For it's a force of habit. It's a force of habit when it comes to these ships that I accident that I actually I think the shields shields are there. Yeah, so it's kind of a force of habit that when I do that. Nope, no fires. <sighs> He's probably gonna get away, isn't he? Alright, and Well, if you have a lot of subs, it means uh, you get a lot of uh, really? He's getting away, isn't he? Yeah, he's jumping. Oh, come on! Ah! Alright, Dr. Jones. I know you were just in a fire and all, but you're gonna have to do something about that one. Yeah, so the point of having 3 million subs, you have no viewers. Well, Google Analytics would say... Google, use Google Analytics. Google Analytics would say, you know, having a great amount of subs means, um, stuff. You get more money, moolahs, cash dollars, the skrilla. Yeah, that sort of thing. And, right, I'm sorry. Getting a bit distracted there. I should, I should be putting these automated ship's weapons out of sync. Yeah, I should, I should get them out of sync, the enemy. Oh, it's got level two doors. I'm gonna use the, I'm gonna use the thermal beam just to make sure it um oh, right those sensors. Thinking, hey, I can try, probably see what's going on in the enemy ship, right? Oh, there's no sensors. So yeah, the whole laser fire. Hmm. Yeah, so I put the um. <laughs> yeah, so I put some stuff on the stuff over there, and now I've got stuff happening. And I think I'm gonna move this chat window into a. Ugh, somewhere else because I, I I I can't seem to be able to pay much attention to the chat and while playing at the same time and I want, I want to hear these, I want to hear these interesting conversations. There we go. Bam! Enemy ship destroyed. And uh, let's see. Okay, sensor scans. Sensor sweep. Nope. Oh, let's put, let's put some extra power on the shields. All right, let's get the battlefield, please. And I got a banter ship coming in. Battle stations, everyone! Let loose the juice! Okay, uh, let's see. They got two lasers. Naturally, they try and, they try and hit everything. Okay, this time my rod screw up! Okay, maybe the timing was a bit off. Oh! Wait, did I... Ah, didn't get the disintegr... Oh, I have to kill them simultaneously. Can't just hit, hit, can't hit all three. Gotta kill them all simultaneously. Alright, here we go. Go! 
No, that's not gonna work, is it? Nope, that didn't work. Well, stuff's on fire and those mantis are probably healing up. And I'm probably gonna take a lot more damage than I should be because, oh no, they're healed up now. And look at that, my laser, ugh. And then of course they hit my weapon system, so of course now I can't operate. Now I can't operate the stuff I wanted to operate. Yeah, it's a burning anti-bio beam, but the problem is, um... They really are being irritating with their weaponry. They really are just being irritating with their weaponry. Oh, and they hit oxygen, of course, because why not? Why not hit oxygen? Hey, why not hit everything on the ship? It's not like I have anything of... Not like I have anything of value, right? Okay, now everyone's on fire again. And of course, I hit piloting. Now the Renji's also... I think something's on fire. I think something's on fire on the ship. So it's a precaution. So I can, I can hear the hiss, hissing sounds. I can hear the, uh sizzling sounds of a fire. Alright, go! Burn! 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 The love of Manus is burn already! Just burn! Ugh. Seriously, med bays. Is one of my life support, is my life support going up or down? Nope, they're not, they're not burning. Why are they not burning? This doesn't seem right. They're not burning. Why bad guy not burn? Well, something was burning. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Seriously, I wanted to burn that thing and... They wouldn't let me indulge my dreams of pyromania. Actually, that's, that's horrifi horrifying. Aha! The animation's gone! We've waited a long time for this! Well, engage. <laughs> engage! You have the helm, number one. Yeah, I'm gonna just take everyone out of the... Yeah, I just took everyone out of the helm. <laughs> just for a second. Oh man, I should've put the, uh, common... Ah, didn't put Common Hunter's music pack in. So let's see, fire? Fire! Burn! Ah, uh, yes. First laser mark two and fire everywhere. Fire! <laughs> oh, I saw that one. <laughs> that was a... That's a good run. That was a good one, having all those fire. <laughs> yes! Let's see what he's doing now. Nope. Not... Nope. Of course, I hit piloting. Bam! Kablamski. Oh, and look at that, he's running out. <laughs> I guess the shield room got too hot to handle. The heat is on. Oh, and look at that. I got another, I got another human. I got another foolish meat sack to be put on the ship. And I can upgrade shields. Throw that in. Next priority, I think, is going to be weapons. Let's see, if I go for the distress signal... Hopefully I can probably get, probably get some scrap, maybe then go to the store, see if I can buy some time. Since I have limited time offer. And nope, not gonna go to the store then. Ouch. Okay, I'm beelining, I'm, I'm threading the needle here, I'm beelining for the exit. Head inside the scrapyard. Ready? Ready on your course, number one. Attack the slaver scum! We're going in! Get tactical, Marines! Get swifty! Go, go, go! Kill that mantis! Kill that mantis! They can't harm me, though. Their weapons are useless. But they still have a, uh... They still have the problem of the, um... They have a... Oh, never mind about the... Stuff. What they do have is a, um... Med bay. So 
do this. What the other option if I just don't go the scrap if I don't if I don't take the option I just avoid the scrapyard altogether. Which you know as in terms of a if you're trying to loot stuff you don't want to avoid the scrapyard. That, that, that'd be stupid. I mean, who does that? Who do such a thing? Who would avoid the scrapyard just to? Yeah, who would avoid the scrapyard? You don't. You don't avoid the scrap. You don't avoid the moolah. Basically, it's giving you a chicken out option. Yeah, you got two options. You can just not go there, or you can, or you can check it out. We'll see out. Well, your med bay's down, and your weapons are down. Of course, I have a rockman on board, so the rockman can fix it. Because his name's Felix. Go, burn! Oh, their engines burned. Ho ho! No, the scrapyard can have bad outcomes. If you um, go to the scrapyard and you can encounter an auto ship that's not quite dead yet. Yeah, you can, you can encounter an auto ship that isn't dead. So, there is a bad outcome and that could be a good outcome as well. It's, you know, hey, free free stuff. Oh, look at that, a mantis! That's right, foolish meat sacks. I'm here. Ohm is here to, I don't know, do stuff about... Ohm is here! Do not resist! Sorry, there we go. I know it's um, I know it's like Ohm Wrecker, but hey, come on, come on. I'm trying, I'm trying to make a um electrical jo electric joke here. <laughs> I'm trying to, I'm trying to keep up with the current news. Yeah, okay, that that was horrible. <laughs> that was a terrible pun. But then again, then again, you want to know a terrible joke? piece of paper. <laughs> ah, that was terrible. Especially when it got wet. <laughs> pew. Pew pew. No, I shouldn't be actually I shouldn't actually be making the gun sounds because I've got an audio pack for that. Where I actually do, where I actually do make the gun sounds. I actually do go <laughs> pew pew <laughs> and all that. <laughs> I caught the enhanced audio pack. The best thing ever. Okay, maybe it's not as good as limousine in space, but it comes damn close to it. And I got some bad news for you, boys. You're in space! What's that, Mr. Zoltan? Oh, you just got beamed! What, seriously? This is not 60 damage, right? So, he's about on one hit point, didn't he? That's the only thing I can think of as to how you survived. Well, now I can up, now I can operate both, now I can operate all the guns at the same time if I had to. No, I need the fuel. Mantis controlled or civilian sector? Hmm, let's see. Mantis controlled. Good chances are they're going to send boarding teams over, so I can kill the boarding team, and then wipe them out. Wipe them out! And then, of course, naturally, since I'm in the Mantis Sector... <laughs> of course, the only thing you do encounter in Mantis Sectors are automated ships. I mean, it's just common sense, isn't it? But, you know, automated ships are prowling the these sectors. Alright, let's fire again. Hopefully we can hit something. Okay, delayed, good. That's good to know. Fire the whole laser again. What I will need is a better weapon. Alright, let's see if I can uh, stop the repairs. No, don't know if I did stop the repairs or not. So I'm probably going to aim for the engines. Didn't hear a whole breach, but the engines are down. Take any chances. Oh, the shield's back up. It's really, don't know if I set something on fire though. Alright, so there we go. I mean, something probably got burned. Something got burned, right? Please tell me something got burned. 
Well, there you go. Now they can't escape. And now something got damaged over there. Come on, everyone, get 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 repairs. I know. I know the um. I know they managed to send their ships and stuff to the to these sectors, but the thing is, there's a lot of these. There's a lot of man. Like I get a lot of um automated ships in Manta sectors. It just becomes one of those things where um you're just wondering, what, like, is this a Manta sector or is this a Rebel sector? Hmm. So as they say on Rick and Morty, oh, it's answer the stress beacons, but I'll answer that a little bit later. <sighs> and of course, I get boarded. Well, everyone, everyone who's willing and able, or Kane and able, let's get them all out of here. Let's get everyone into the, get, oh, right, uh, get everyone, okay, emergency event pattern 23, emergency event protocol 23. Oh, okay, interesting. Interesting, then... Fine, here you go, come on in, come on in everyone, come on in, have fun, have fun wrecking my med, oh, really good if I had the med bay on, wouldn't it be? Alright, come on, seriously, you're going to go in the oxygen room, you're going to destroy life support, like, I know you really want to kill us on the ship, but Hey, let's go, let's go, I'm going to go into life support and wipe them all out. Now wait, med bay's open again. And then, you know. <laughs> yeah, I did slap your avatar onto a cake. <laughs> hey, come on. <laughs> I mean, come on, it's a... <laughs> it was a cake ship. Designing it was a piece of cake. Okay. This is the giant, this is the, this is the giant alien spiders event, except without the giant alien spiders, it's more giant alien robots. Does it come into, no, they're no, that's no joke. <laughs> okay, I've, I've, I've um, tried that one before, and what happens is it ends up, it ended up horribly. And look at that, and then of course, you know what I get afterwards? <laughs> the giant alien spiders. The monsters started bursting in flame as we watched. What a terrifying weapon. Yeah. Uh, I demand the surrender. I demand the surrender of your goods. Good, sir. Oh, you're trying to escape, are you? Well, then. How about I give you an anti-personnel bomb in your face? Hmm? Don't like that? Too bad. Right, shields up, shields up, shields up! Shields up, number one, and of course you fail. You fail, number one. Alright, so, preparing the hole laser. Kablamski! Haha! <laughs> okay, nope, number one. That didn't work too well as I thought it would. Alright, shields, okay, auction's down, we need... We need, the, we need the back online now-ish. I say now-ish. Fire! Alright, fire. Oh, he survived? Come on! Alright, any personnel bomb off. We need more power to the engines and we need divert power now. Okay, there we go. Power's been diverted. Charge up the, um, charge up the anti-fire beam. Come on, fire, charge faster! No you don't! And I got a bomb out of it. Woo! <laughs> right, uh, let's see, where do I jump to now? And should I actually put some more power into something? Oh yeah, so I got a whole, I got two different bomb weapons now. Hmm, okay, so that's interesting. Doesn't seem to do a, um... Damage crew, but not the hull. Okay. Right, so... <sighs> I know I'm in a Manta sector, so I should get everyone healed up. 
All right, I'm gonna throw an extra bit of power into something. So in case I have to divert it, I can do that. I can divert power right away. So yeah, I have a spare bar of power just in case. All right, I've got some computer components. Yay! All right, let's let's uh, run off the let's bounce off. The, let's I don't know. Send someone in the pod. I indeed sense a uh, friggin' hell. No. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> I'm not doing that one. I'm not that stupid. I mean, I'm, I can be stupid at the game at times, but not that stupid. Full power to the ship assets, Mr. Number One. All oh, right, so let's see. Uh, I think I might need the power bomb for this one. So I'm expecting an I'm expecting a beam. Oh, be beam and asteroid barrages everywhere. Well, there we go. Their, their, their ship is doomed. Their ship is doomed. Yeah, they are doomed. Maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I got. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, I think is the answer. Then again, does mean? Ha ha! Yes. It does mean, however, I can just. <laughs> it does open up the ship for. For a nice beam or two. All right, let's go to the store. See what we can see if I can gamble on something that can do some better damage. Limited time offer. Random equipment. Random weapon. Ionic heavy laser. That's not bad. Not bad at all. And let's see. I'll sell the computer components. Now, if I was playing as um Captain's Edition, oh look at this eight personnel shotgun for 120. So if I sold Let's see, if I sell this, I get 87. Okay, that'd be 102. Then I have to sell something else. But this any personnel shotgun might be what I need to get the edge on something. Uh. But I want to keep I want to keep the heavy laser. Let's do that, and I'm just one short. <sighs> So I might have to sell the power bomb. Then go for the anti-personnel shotgun. Got enough power? Alright, yeah. Okay, anti-personnel shotgun. Plus the beam. Well, okay. What I'm actually gonna do is I'm going to probably save up some money for, save up some scrap for the um, extra weapons power. Alright, look, judging by that, judging by the Radius there. I, I can think I can spare one jump, and I ha of course, Look, I'm not a, I'm not a big fan of the um like hands up scrapyard. There we go. Here's what I mean. We got this. Prepare to fight, Team Rocket here. Hi, Team Rocket here. <laughs> Let's see if I if I fire. BAM! Ha-ha! <laughs> Inter- Oh, it so did a breach. Did a whole breach. Whole breach. Whole breach. So now that- I think the shields are down forever. But when I say forever, it just means a really long time. Oh! Snap! Oh, Snapski! Can slam! Yeah, now I have to exit the sector, but... For the moment, that's a um, that was a that was an acceptable outcome, I guess. I mean, there were probably outcomes that were better than that, but like I guess that's an acceptable outcome. I accept that outcome, and I think I should use that one in the future. All right, everyone, return to whatever you were doing before. Steady as she goes, number one. Okay, Uncharted Nebula, Amanda's home worlds. Well, home worlds. Hmm, <laughs> it's a lot of course. Set the course, and it's gonna be Kazakh, right? Kazakh. No? Alright, distress signal. Come on, distress signal, what do you got? 
We can do something about this. Hey, it's that ion weapon thing. And look at that, got a reward out of it. Sorry I'm going through the events very quickly, I just know a lot of these events, so... In most cases, I'm like, yep, I know this event, don't care, I'm gonna go through it quickly. And look at that, I'm gonna wreck you. With my own wreck, with own wrecker. So let's see. Oh, the missile missed. Which is surprising, considering the fact it's a missile. Cole! Oh! Ho, 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 ho! Then my weapons went down, but... Seriously, look at that! That was... The stuff of legend. Except for the part where... Now I have to wait... Now their weapons are gonna go back online. Mine are... Currently down. Their, we their, we their missiles are on. Everyone return to your stations. Shields up, which is not gonna help, because... They got, they got that. And a Corso. Great. And a Corso starts two fires, naturally. Fire! Aha! Come on. Extinguish that. Extinguish the fire already, guys. Come on. Seriously. Okay, and now I can't actually leave yet because I have to wait for this. I have to wait for the ion cycle to power down. Stars RG, why don't you just power down all, all your systems? Because. Because. Because, my dear Watson. I'm clear! Haha! <laughs> I don't gamble with crooks, I'm jumping. Ugh, I need fuel! Need my fuel! Attack the ship, move in! Move in, everyone! All stations! All hands! All hands! Oh yeah, the anti-personnel shotgun's pretty good. <laughs> It'll last. Is that a fire? Is that a fire on board? Nope. Oh, snap a Rooney. Okay. Come on, fire the shotgun again. Fire again. Next! Next! Full missile impact, please! Yay! I escaped! Your ship would make a mighty fine prize! Oh, these dudes. The shipbreakers. The shipbreaker dudes. That's what I'm gonna call them. The shipbreaker dudes. Got my eyes on! <laughs> Fire! Wait for it. All right, they're in. They're going in. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Whoa. Hey, I got a free weapon out of that. <laughs> oh. <sighs> yeah, but look at my hull. It's it's horrifying. No, I don't yet. Okay, yeah, the that that, that, that gam man the mantis gambling thing, yeah, that's um interesting. I there's a blue option for it, because I've never got that. Yeah, I don't understand. Is there a store? Yes there is. I think a store will trump anything. Okay, let's see. Limited time offer. View consumable offers. Three, four, yep, I'll take that. I'll take that. Don't have enough of the cloaky device, but I do need hull repairs. Can I sell anything? Hmm, burst laser mark three. Great to have that, like... Now the question is, do I keep this? I don't want to keep this in storage, because, uh, because these two will be, like... These two are pretty good weapons to have. These are pretty good weapons to have, but the thing is, is that... The thing is, is... I could just do that, and then put an extra power, put an extra... Let's see, shot for shot. Shot for shot, though. Yeah, I'll do that. Hmm. 
Yeah, FTR modding isn't that difficult. I mean, I've done a few. I've done a lot of Zoltan ships and stuff. That's kind of one of the things I do. Is I, I work. I, I work with some strange ships. A man ship with the market of a warrior tribe. Well, aren't they all kind of warrior tribe? I mean, is there a man to science tribe or something? I mean, you know, they they slight they dissect things with their claws for science. I don't know. Aha! Foolish meat sacks. We are here to. We are here to bring in, bring in peer-reviewed science. Aha! Because you know that's sort of what the manders do. They they probably have like Kazakh fly the Kazakh flick the science guy, the science mantis. All right, they missed. Wow, I actually hit their missiles. What? Everyone, the Manda, like clearly. Have you seen the Manda scientists? I mean, <laughs> hey, check your privileges. <laughs> Kazakh, Kazakh flick the science. Kazakhly, the science mantis guy, and he, and he does show, and he does like things like um, he talks about controversial subjects like um, not slaughtering the, not slaughtering foolish meat sacks who stumble upon the, who stumble upon manta space. What you thought I have a, you thought we were my own science show that I was going to not talk about how we foolishly slaughter everyone? Ooh, uh, wait, this is Kazakh. This is Kazaf the War. Hmm. As you can see, you are no matter the true mind of the Mantis. You have five minutes to leave this place. Oh, do you think you can challenge me? Very well. Prepare for battle. And don't even think about holding back. Well, charge. <laughs> insert. Insert the bu insert bugle. Do, 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 do. Charge! <laughs> then again, maybe work on the Klingons. Um, the Klingons actually, like the Klingons in Star Trek, can have lawyers because they do stuff like you know they er, er, to, to a Klingon, everything is a battle. So you know they they fought a battle against they fought a battle against scientific ignorance and they brought back knowledge. They fought a battle against ignorance, and they brought back knowledge as, as, as spoils of war. Oh no, everything's on fire! No, oh, everything's burning! Yeah, come on to the med bay, everyone. Come in the med bay. Well, they still have missiles online. Oop. Uh, no, their man just died. No, no, their man just didn't die. That one didn't. That one did. All right, everyone, out of the shield room. We're venting oxygen now. Go. Okay, well, at least I'm killing stuff. And the whole lady's not going to work. Yeesh, I'm down to my shotgun. You two, go repair weapons. Like, seriously, why haven't you repaired weapons? And Oh, no, hull breach, hull breach. Heal up, everyone, heal up. Fire shotguns. Okay, that guy's dead. Oh, come on, weapons are down again. Arr, stop killing my stuff! Stop killing everything! Okay, finally they're out of bombs. Get rid of that fire now. Fire! Oh, no, it's a fire! Something died there. You, get in there. You, get in there. See, seal it up now. Get in there. Seal it up. Seal it all up. Come on. Auctions online. <sighs> we are there. What the? More, more damage everywhere. Stop destroying everything. Stop destroying all my ship. 
Don't touch any of my ship! Okay, get out of there, Dr. Jones. No, wait, get back in there. No time for loving, Dr. Jones! Seriously, come on! Jeez. Is everything not on fire? Well, okay, everything on their ship is on fire, but... Wait, ugh. Hey, and I got storage key Sigma. <sighs> right, whoa. Okay. Yeesh. Yeesh, ugh. That was a uh, difficult battle to get through. Okay, everyone. Return to your stations, repair everything. And let's get to the exit. Let's get to the escape pods. Actually, no. I have one. I can. I can just jump here. What have they got? They got a fire. Oh! <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I am the beep. Boom. <laughs> Slam! Ski. Okay, doors are down and oh, fire drone setting everything on fire. I mean, that's what a fire drone does, right? It just sets stuff on fire. But I can't, you know, have the have everything down. Ooh, look at that! Whoa! I'm wrecking shop here. Oop. And I got a human. I got a foolish meat sack out of that. <laughs> wow, that was a. I thought the battle was going to be a bit of a problem, but nope. That, that one ended rather, rather anticlimactically. I thought, I thought we were getting, getting a bit more time, but nope. There you go. Someone's dead. <laughs> All right, Siona and Ohm, you're going to be sitting there, sitting pretty. So we jump to the exit. All right, and we're going to wrong range beacon. Fend for yourself. Attack and escape. Let's see what they got. Okay, probably the, that's a charge laser, I think. Charge laser, that's a regular laser. Come on, yes, shields are up again. Alright. Fire that. Fire the shotgun. Alright. Next target. Ugh. Seriously, how do, how do I... You know what? Seriously, it's, it's distracting, so I'm going to... Ugh, remove them from the stream. Oh wait, that's not how- Ugh, seriously? Go away. <laughs> Alright, and fire! Again! Okay, I don't know. But it's showing it's gonna show up on my stream. So that's the problem, it's gonna show up on my stream, I think. All right, looks like everyone's looks like everyone's on the run. All right, and fire. Okay, and of course they can't escape because they're dead. That's because they're dead. <laughs> and NG Homeworlds. Uh, okay, I'm gonna keep the stream going, but I'm going to um, well, I should mod bio um. I've already, yeah, but I'm going to keep the stream going, but I'm going to end the recording here. So, for those who are going to be watching on YouTube later on, um, yeah, thanks for watching. Um, this is RJ, and I'm going to tip the scales in the favour. Hopefully, of this, hopefully the scales can be tipped in the favour of the ship. Signing off. Five minutes later. <laughs> can we help out? No, of course not. No, of course not. Sorry, you are not. It's not for humans. And I'll be like, seriously, you guys are racist. Accept your invitation, okay? Oh, recent detective, advanced space vessel armor, so self restoring material, pro progress significant, stress tests required. Oh, this is the one, I've heard this event before. Advanced rebel assault crowd on internet course. Chance of surviving direct attack is 3.7%. Requesting immediate assistance. Red alert! Red alert! <coughs> yeah, like the Star, Star Trek alarms. So. I think my first priority is take out those guns. Okay, never mind. First priority is trying to figure out why why this thing is not is not going to try how how not to get killed by this thing. And you know, get, then, then get killed by this thing. Oh, this is a this is gonna be a quick run, isn't it? Yep, GG everyone. 
Yeah, GG. <laughs> yeah, GG. Yep. <laughs> <sighs> well. Wow. Just wow. <laughs> I'm gonna throw this at the end of the video. <laughs> like, seriously, that is like worst luck. <sighs> yeah. So, thanks for watching. <laughs> thanks. Nope. Too late. I'm dead. <laughs> Yep, I'll throw this at the end anyway. I'll start a new ship, I guess, because... Yeah, why not? Why not? Should I start a new ship? Probably.